What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen bringing a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you're new here, make sure to smash the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we are here in Greenville and we literally just heard on the news that there's going to be massive flooding coming to the town you guys so i'm very very nervous we're actually going to head to the bulk foods right now and get some supplies so we can stay inside for quite a while you guys because look at this the sky is already turning gray which means the storms are coming any second from now so let's get on the road right now you guys and let's go stock up on some essentials make sure that we have everything we need before the storm arrives as you guys can see we got our lift to tahoe in case we do need to evacuate this is the vehicle that we need because guys let me tell you we are not going to be getting stuck in a lot of water so let's get on the main road right now head to bulk foods get all the essentials and then we are going to turn on the news and see what is happening as you guys can see a lot of people are out and about on the road right now making sure that they have everything that they need to make it through this crazy storm you guys i am so nervous honestly i don't know what to expect but they said this is the largest rainfall that they've ever seen coming to the town ever so this is going to be absolutely insane hopefully hopefully it misses us but you just never know you guys so we're gonna be arriving at the grocery store in just a few minutes hopefully they have some things left in stock because as you guys can see look at all those people leaving the grocery store right now there's probably nothing left at all i am so scared you guys honestly i'm so scared all right we're gonna be getting there in just a few minutes and we're gonna get all the essentials that we can before we have to head home as soon as possible oh my goodness as you guys can see it is already raining here already it is not looking good oh my goodness guys it is literally so dark out already and the rain is already happening so we're pulling up at the grocery store right now as you guys can see it is literally empty seems like the whole entire grocery store is probably cleaned out right now so we're gonna have to hurry inside right now get everything we need and then get on the road back home you guys oh my goodness this is going to be crazy so here we are at the grocery store seems like they have a decent amount of stock left so let's get the shopping cart we're gonna grab what we need and we are gonna go as soon as possible oh my goodness guys i'm really really scared okay we gotta go we gotta go we gotta go all right we got some canned goods we gotta get some chips over here and we gotta go as soon as possible let's go let's go let's go you guys oh my goodness as you guys can see some other shoppers are here right now but we are getting on the road as you guys can see it is literally so dark outside right now this is actually insane i've never seen it like this ever guys the skies are literally pitch black this is absolutely insane oh my goodness i guess we might as well stop at the gas station and get a full tank of gas in case we do need to evacuate the town as well we do not want to get stuck with little gas you guys because that would be absolutely horrible luckily we got the optional lift kit on this thing because let me tell you this thing is not getting stuck at all seriously this thing is literally probably 10 feet off the ground it is so tall and it is the best for off-roading guys so luckily we have everything that we may need also pack some supplies on the roof of the vehicle in case we do have to evacuate we got like some emergency supplies we got some blankets we got some clothes and we got some food that we just got from the grocery store right now in case we do need to take cover you guys so we are going to be arriving at the gas station in just a few minutes fill up the gas tank and then we are going to be headed home to take cover hopefully our house does not flood you guys because let me tell you you can see a lot of people outside watching the storm as it rolls in but this is going to be the most dangerous storm to ever arrive in greenville wisconsin history ever you guys so we're pulling up to the gas station right now you guys hopefully hopefully they have some fuel in stock so we can get everything we need and then we got to get home oh my gosh you guys it is just not looking good at all here in greenville all right here we are carpool with friends all right here we go everybody let's go we might have to carpool with some people because let me tell you not everybody has a giant suv like this to make it through this crazy crazy weather condition so here we go you guys filling up the gas tank right now want to make sure we have a full tank all right there we go let's get back on the road and let's head home for the rest of the evening and see what could be coming to the town you guys are going to watch the news and see if everything's going to be okay you know they said that this is going to be horrible so we just don't know what to expect until the storm fully arrives it has been pouring rain for the last few hours you guys so i'm extremely extremely nervous because the last storm that happened like this my entire house got flooded and we had to leave town to go visit uncle lincoln so this is gonna be a crazy one i know it is because we always get these crazy flood storms here in greenville wisconsin all right you guys um, i'm gonna be checking my phone right now oh my gosh it literally says wow it could be up to five feet of rain are you kidding me 
Oh my gosh, five feet of rain, you guys. That is actually unbelievable. Seriously. Oh my gosh, this guy like broke down in the middle of the street. Hopefully he's okay. All right, guys, we're headed back home right now, and we are going to be taking shelter until this storm passes us by, but you never know. It might not even pass us by, you guys, so that is a little bit scary. We're going to be having our cousin stay over with us as well because he literally is visiting in town right now, so hopefully everything will be okay. So we're going to be getting in the house right now, and we're going to be taking cover. Let's get the groceries inside the house and make sure that everything else stays safe. So nothing else gets damaged, you guys. So here we are right now, and let's get inside, put all the groceries away. You guys don't know if the power is going to go out or not. You just never know. So we're going to put everything in there right now, and we will be just fine. Luckily, we still have power. Unfortunately, the news is not covered in the storm right now. But guys, let me tell you, this is going to be a bad one. You guys can see a lot of people are taking shelter in their homes right now because they do not know what to expect. we got a bunch of the neighbors out over here right now, but it seems like the town is pretty much a ghost town right now nobody is getting on the roads right now and they are just taking shelter for now you guys so we are going to hopefully hopefully get a little bit more rain but guys let me tell you they are saying it is not going to be good so we're gonna have to see what will happen and we'll let you guys know oh my goodness you guys the power literally just went out luckily we still have a fire going right now i cannot believe this is happening you guys this storm is not looking good at all. They are saying to head home for your safety because a curfew has begun. But guys, I really want to go out there and see if everybody's okay. Seems like some of our neighbors still have their power, which I am very jealous about because they literally are living their best lives over here. We can literally not see anything at all. Honestly, I think I'm going to get in the truck and I'm going to go see what everyone else is doing in the town right now because, guys, I am not staying home in this. We're going to see if the town is okay. Make sure if anybody needs any help, we are going to go out there and help them so let's get on the road right now you guys i am so nervous because we are literally without power right now we literally have groceries in the refrigerator but they'll only last a couple hours which is not good at all especially with this crazy weather you guys we need to keep food in the fridge but i am really scared right now so let's get on the main road right now as you guys can see police are patrolling and they're trying to get everyone home right now people are literally running in their homes with panic so i've never seen something like this in my entire life you guys this is definitely going to be a bad one they are saying that there's going to be so much rain that you know we might even have to leave the town you guys everything is going to be flooded and everything is going to be ruined so i'm really really nervous seems like the town is not too bad although the streets are starting to fill up with a little bit of water it is going to be a lot worse as you guys can see there is a bunch of people right over there at this house over here we might want to go see if they're okay because it seems like you know they are a little bit stressed i'm gonna go over there and make sure that they're okay because guys let me tell you it is not looking good at all so we're gonna go over there right now and we are going to see if they are okay all right guys here we go we're gonna do a u-turn right over here hopefully we do not get a ticket from the police i'm a little bit scared but hopefully hopefully we'll be okay all right guys we are going to the house right over here we're gonna see if everything is going okay for these people because there's a bunch of people outside right now hopefully hopefully they'll be okay guys look at all these people out here right now what in the world oh my goodness are you guys okay out here are you guys okay out here right now everything okay oh my gosh this storm is getting really really bad out here just want to make sure you guys are doing okay i'm just going around the town uh my power literally went out at my house right now so i'm just going around town to see if everybody else is doing okay but you guys are lucky that your power is still working honestly all right, well, I'm going to get going back home right now, but they're saying that the road conditions are not the best, so we got to be careful, and we got to make sure that we get home as soon as possible. So let's go right now, you guys. This is crazy. The wind is picking up right now. The rain is pouring so fast. We are literally just going to drive with our emergency hazard because we want people to be able to see us. But guys, you can see the rain and the wind is literally throwing the Tahoe in the lane right now. I've never seen something like this in my entire life. It's seriously unbelievable. As you guys can see, there is a lot of people at home right now. There is literally nobody on the road but us. We're going to do a little bit of a quick drive through the neighborhood to make sure everything's okay. But as you guys can see, there is a lot of EMS out and about making sure that everybody's okay. But guys, this is crazy. Look at this. 
Oh my goodness, guys. What is going on over here? It seems like we got a lot of people. We got a tow truck over here. I mean, this is just unbelievable. So let's get back home right now and let's take shelter. Maybe we'll do some more exploring when the major storm passes by, you guys, because I know there's going to be a lot of damage to the town, but hopefully, hopefully everybody will be just fine and hopefully our house does not get destroyed, you guys. So we are finally back at home right now. We're going to be headed inside. Unfortunately, our power is still out right now. Oh my gosh, guys, flash flood warning, stay at high grounds, oh no, I am scared, I am scared, you guys, this is not good, this is not good, oh my gosh, luckily we still got our phones and the radio to listen to because they said that we need to stay on high grounds, you guys, oh my goodness, I am so scared right now, take a deep breath, we're gonna be just fine, as you guys can see, it is still pouring rain right now, not much of a difference, but guys, this is going to get really, really bad, really quick, I can tell you. All right, let's look out our back door right now. As you guys can see, not much happening out here right now, but they are saying that the rain is gonna be coming down even quicker than it is right now, and that is going to lead to a massive flood in the city. All right, you guys, it seems like the flooding is happening right now, so let's get on the road and let's see what is happening here right now. I am so scared to see the damage to the city. It seems like it is not good at all. So we're gonna get in the car right now, and we are gonna get on the main highway and see what is happening here in the town. But guys, let me tell you, they already said we have multiple inches of rainfall that has already happened here in Greenville. The flash flood is still happening right now so they say to be extra extra careful so we're gonna see what's going on here and we're gonna make sure that everybody is okay so we're gonna get back on the main highway right now you guys i am so scared to see as you guys can see on the sides of the roads it is literally filling up with water it is not looking good at all oh my gosh guys someone literally hydropain and lost control over there hopefully they are okay but guys let me tell you the sides of the streets are literally filling up with water as you guys can see right over there i mean this is actually unbelievable look at this you guys oh my goodness this is absolutely unbelievable you guys i've never seen so much rainfall in my entire life you guys this is crazy look at this oh my goodness oh my goodness guys this is literally unreal you guys it is literally like we're driving through lake greenville right now this is absolutely unbelievable we're gonna take a turn right over here and we're gonna see what else is going on down here but guys the whole entire city is literally flooded right now these houses are literally flooded with water this is not good at all look at this you cannot even see the lake anymore you guys this is actually unreal oh my goodness guys I can't believe this right now. Seriously, the whole town is literally destroyed, especially these homes right over here. They are completely filled with water, you guys. This is a disaster. Oh my gosh. They're urging people to pack their bags and to leave town if your home is literally flooded, you guys. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Guys, look at this. I cannot even make it through right now. This is not good. My Tahoe is literally barely making it through right now. I can't believe this is happening, you guys. Oh my gosh, we're barely making it right now. This is unbelievable, you guys. So we're trying to get through this. Looks like someone's truck is literally stuck over here right now. I guess we should have not come down this road because, guys, it is really bad right now. It is literally halfway up my wheels this is crazy guys so let's get back on the main road right now seems like someone is literally trying to escape this you guys because their vehicle is stuck on the side of the road so we're gonna go explore the rest of the town and see what else is happening but as you guys can see these sides of the roads are literally filled up with water as well that might be the worst of the city you guys because let me tell you lake greenville is right there and lakeville neighborhood is completely gone seriously it is not good not good at all you guys all right let's go down here right now and let's see what else is happening on this main highway but you guys i just can't believe this this is seriously a nightmare look at this someone has literally crashed and stuck in the river over there this is not good oh my gosh i think they shut down the road are you kidding me right now you guys look at this are you kidding me excuse me excuse me excuse me um i need to get through i need to get through to go home okay i need to get through to go home you guys hopefully they will let me through excuse me officer i need to get through here please are you kidding me right now look at this bmw why would they literally try to go through here i can't believe you guys look at this this is just unbelievable officer excuse me can i get through it's too dangerous um i'll survive okay I'll survive, okay? All right, guys, let's see. We're gonna try and get through here, okay? We're gonna get through. Oh my gosh, the cop is not happy. All right, he goes, all right. 
All right, guys, we're gonna try and make it through this. Hopefully, hopefully we can make it through. I'm a little bit nervous, you guys. I really am. Uh-oh. The Tahoe is barely making it through this right now, you guys. This is actually unbelievable. We're literally going like two miles per hour right now. This is not good. Uh-oh, guys. I really hope we do not get stuck over here right now. The police are trying to close down the road, but, you know, I wanted to get through to see what actually was happening. But, guys, oh, my. This probably was not the best choice, you guys. Seriously, this looks horrible look at this look at this you guys i cannot believe this has happened the whole entire town is ruined you guys i am actually really sad that this has happened you guys the entire town is going to have to be rebuilt because the water is damaged these homes it's damaged so much you guys seriously this is just just so sad so hopefully um, we'll be able to get through this you guys i know greenville's a tough community and you know we always get through these crazy natural disasters but you just never know it's going to take a very long time to rebuild everything we are just not going to stop you guys because let me tell you if i stop i know my vehicle is going to get stuck so we're going to keep going luckily we got the optional lifted suspension on this thing because let me tell you it definitely is coming in handy today because let me tell you we would be completely stuck if we did not have this lifted suspension but as you guys can see we are barely making it through here going three miles per hour right now this is so crazy all right guys we are barely making it through you guys i can't believe it i can't believe it right now okay we are surviving we're surviving come on let's go let's go we can make it through we can make it through as you guys can see it's pretty much only trucks and suv and firefighters that are out and about in these conditions because anyone else if you have a sedan you guys you will be in major major trouble and you literally would be stuck you guys so we're super grateful that we have this vehicle i don't even think i'm going to be able to stop at this red light up here because i think i'll get stuck honestly hopefully we can make it through this light you guys we are literally trying right now okay we're gaining some speed we're gaining some speed here we go you guys here we go finally finally we're making it through right now we're making it through oh my goodness here we go we're making it through right now and we are surviving you guys as you guys can see seems like some people are getting stuck over here right now guess they should have got a larger suv guys as you can see their vehicles literally halfway filled with water oh my oh my you guys look at this the gas station is literally covered with water you guys oh my gosh the whole entire parking lot is gone you guys can hardly see anything this is unreal this is absolutely unreal you guys so we are gonna try and get back home right now and make sure our house is not flooded but you just never know you guys you just never know hopefully everything will be savable in our house but honestly at least we are okay at least our vehicle is working right now and we should be just fine so we're gonna try and make it back to our house right now it is gonna take us a very long time because let me tell you these back roads are very very full of water they do need to add some more drainage back there because let me tell you when we get these massive storms here in greenville wisconsin it literally causes a huge huge pile up of rain and we are literally in major trouble you guys we are literally having to go through this red light because let me tell you if we stop our vehicle will be done we cannot stop you guys we cannot stop so we're going we're going we're going we're gonna be just fine i know we will but we're going seven miles an hour it's better than the three miles per hour we were doing earlier because let me tell you look at how deep the water is right now it is seriously getting up there you guys it is getting up there so hopefully everybody can stay safe in the town hopefully these people are not stuck up here because guys let me tell you i will not be able to stop and help them because we are not going to get stuck in this because we do not want to call the tow truck it is going to be like thousands and thousands of dollars to get the vehicle out of this because we do not want to deal with that so we are going to be trying to get back home right now it is going to take us some time to get through this slowly but surely i know we will you guys but what a crazy crazy day hopefully the weather will clear up and we get our beautiful spring weather back very soon i really hope so because guys let me tell you i cannot deal with this rain okay it is hard to be stuck in the house all day we literally lost power and we were trapped in our house for so long we're just grateful that we had a great community there to make sure that everyone is okay you know we checked in with people and we made sure that they were doing okay as well so we're gonna get home right now and we're gonna see hopefully our cousin that is visiting us and is literally not freaking out because he literally never seen anything like this in his life and you know it's been a while since we had a massive flood like this in greenville so we are just doing okay and that's fine you guys so what a crazy day it has been i hope that you guys did enjoy today's video if you guys did make sure you guys smash the like button leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe to join the wanny family today thanks so much for watching if you made it to the end of the video you are awesome and we will be seeing you guys in the next one bye everybody